Hello, bastards and bricklayers. My name is TB Skine, and welcome back to Mass Effect 3, where uh, we've been through the DLC. We have done basically all of the side quests that are available to do, and it's about time that we actually save this goddamn galaxy, I think. First, I do want to go check out my weapons and stuff, because we're about to head into the very end game, which means it's probably about time that I spent the last of my money. So what do I have the money to buy? Not the Valiant. <laughs> I'm close, though. Well, no, I'm not, actually. But I can imagine. can imagine that I'm close. Nah, I want to use the... I want to use the new armor. Okay. With that, I think we are good to go. Yeah? Yeah. Never mind. That's not important. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go attack Cerberus, shall we? Let's go finish the bastards off. The Reapers and Cerberus started this. Now we're gonna end it. I'll get the fleets mobilized. Shepard. Thought you might be up here. Do you know what the best part is about a battle that decides the whole fate of the galaxy? Winning it? I was thinking it's a good excuse to remind the ones you care about that. Yeah, well, you care about them. Want some company? Like, see, even in this, which is the romance scene, he's still wearing, like, they've just draped a different skin over it, but it's still the armored suit model, right? Like, all the Turian, they don't have an out-of-the-suit model, except, of course, as we saw in the Omega DLC, Nyrene had one where she's not wearing that big-ass, bulky, fucking, chunky bird suit. And I just, I just wish... He read my mind. Guess I'm getting pretty good at this. But some more practice wouldn't hurt. Shepard. Here we are again then. That's Morton. Morden's voice. Why do you sleep on top of the covers? Oh, right, because they didn't animate. Couldn't with this. I think it's it's literally that they kind of couldn't unless they hand animated all of it. Bad dream. You ever get them? tend to expect the worst anyway, so dreaming about it is just a waste of good sleep. What about now? I'm expecting a tough fight. What's bothering you? Can we ever be ready for a battle like this? Everything we've ever known. It's all hanging by a thread, Garrus. Yeah, but the truth is, when hasn't it? 
Every fight we've ever seen could have been our last. Every bullet we've ever dodged could have been the one. <laughs> there have been a lot of bullets. And this time around, they're just a little bigger. <sighs> I don't know what I'd do without you. The strike team is in. We've got our foothold. Fifth Fleet, all forward. I don't want a single server ship in my sky when we're through. Shepard, I should accompany you on this mission. Why? This is the central point of operations for Cerberus. They will have enhanced security measures. With my knowledge of Cerberus algorithms and this body's updated protocols, I offer the best chance to help you succeed. Grab your gear. Yeah, Edie's a mandatory squad mate for this one. We will talk about those dreams, though. Oh boy, will we talk about those. I'm, I'm kind of wondering how... <laughs> I'm wondering how much we're going to talk about those dreams, because it might be a lot. It might be quite a lot. I'm going to want Liara for the rest of it, because I'm going to need her singularity. Joker, what's our status? We've got a foothold, but it's not much, Commander. A lot of fighters guarding the launch base. Can you get us in? It won't be a problem, Commander. Shepard, I am ready. You're taking Edie into Cerberus headquarters? I will be fine, Jeff. Head to the shuttle, Edie. Fifth Fleet's cut through their line. They're regrouping. Now's as good a time as any. Joker. It's going to be a narrow window, Commander. I'd recommend you hurry. Manually. Ah, I think I missed. Nope, I got him. Shepard, they're launching fighters. There's not a shield pylon here, is there? No, but they're snipers, okay. Oh, not snipers, but something. Something annoying, anyway. Uh, I can't see for shit. Yeah, that figures. Yeah, that's Centurion. Heal my squad when I damn well decide to. There we go. Now get up. Oh, Jesus Christ, this gun does a lot of damage. Fuck me. <laughs> Pop out, little sniper. There you go. Then singularity hurt. Thank you. And. 
There we go. Good lord, that gun does a lot of damage. Shepard, Cerberus intends to vent the hangar bay. Can you stop them? I need an active console. Try the upper level. Edie, I've got a console. Go! Hangar vent procedure. Disabled. Can you open the hangar? No. However... I can access their fighter launch controls. Shepard, Cerberus is aware that the venting attempt failed. Reinforcements are inbound. Okay. Well, it seems like I should be able to hit a grenade there. Or not. Still, worked out well enough. Team is inbound. I suspect they know what we're up to. They're not stopping us now. Fuck me, that gun is strong. <laughs> Get down there. Launching fighter. Impressive. The central lab was located behind this hangar. I suggest we follow the fighter's path. Noted. Let's move. Oh, another one of you. Ah, darn. Yeah, no, that's 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 kind of on you, Liara. And then <laughs> handgun, by the way. has updated their encryption. There may be a slight delay as I bypass security. How's Cerberus reacting to us breaching the door? They are sealing off as much of the base as they can. Most obvious routes to the central lab are blocked. Other areas are being fortified. Heavy troopers will attempt to delay us while engineers set up turrets. Any more surprises like venting the hangar? No. I am aware of this facility's safeguards and can counteract them. Cerberus can merely slow us down. And if I hadn't brought you along... Cerberus would have vented the hangar. Thanks for coming. I am pleased to assist. I've died in space once already. I'm not eager to repeat the experience. We must proceed through a sublevel to avoid Cerberus containment measures. Where do you think we'll find the Prothean VI? A central lab at the heart of this facility. It is the most secure area. Following the destruction left by the fighter will offer the most direct route. Okay, this looks like a chest high walls room, yes. I feel like I've discovered a slightly OP weapon. We've killed scores of them. Their intention is to delay us and not stop us. Engineers are currently preparing an organized defense ahead. Can... 
We will be through momentarily. Shepard, that console has not been fully scrubbed. It contains data you may find interesting. What am I looking at? Project Lazarus, your reconstruction. It can't be done. It's not a matter of resources. It's always a matter of resources. We're not losing Shepard. Sir, Shepard is clinically brain dead. After that much trauma, that long with no oxygen, we cannot overcome nature. Operative Lawson disagrees. She is now in charge of Project Lazarus. I didn't realize it was that bad. I saw what was left of you. I thought you knew. Are you all right? I'm still me. I doubt I'd have been able to turn against Cerberus otherwise. I don't remember anything. Maybe they really just fixed me. Or maybe I'm just a high-tech VI that thinks it's Commander Shepard. But I don't know. I'd be surprised if it didn't unnerve you. Tissue regeneration is proceeding. The helmet kept the brain intact for whatever good that will do. Lawson will find a way. Sir, Shepard's an Alliance soldier. As far as she knows, we're a terrorist organization. I'm not looking for a dance partner. We need Shepard, and Shepard needs resources. She'll work with us. He was an excellent judge of character. Every instinct I had told me not to trust Cerberus. But I needed their help, so I played along. You did what was necessary, and now you'll take him down. Project Lazarus is reporting neurological activity. They're requesting more funding. Granted. Get me our potential recruits file. Shepard will be up soon. We need a crew. Our existing forces should be more than sufficient. No. We need sympathetic faces. I need Shepard invested. Tap Kelly Chambers and recruit Donnelly. I imagine Miss Daniels will follow. We want some old friends as well. Contact Dr. Chakwaz and send me the site profile on Shepard's pilot, along with a bottle of 47 Thessia Red. He populated the Normandy with friendly faces, so you never saw Cerberus for what it was. That's what you do when you're trying to indoctrinate someone. How's that door coming, Edie? We are clear to proceed. Detergent team, what's your status? We cleared the hangar and are inside the base. Good work. Do you need support? Negative. Keep the heat on. We'll find what we need. All cut down. Hull integrity may become... We have found the turret! Ah. He died on his feet. <laughs> Fuck me. Be so fucking for real right now. I'm not on like super easy. No, I am on hardcore. Let's let's pump it up to insanity just to just see even the odds a little. I feel like I should not have this easy of a time. Cause like, fuck me, come on. <laughs> that is ridiculous. I will bypass the lock. If you are interested, the console nearby is still functional. I am interested. Uh Sims indicate that the enhanced defense intelligence gives the highest combat improvement on frigates. Anything heavier, and the ships react too slowly to benefit from Edie's advice. Edie? Oh, that's, uh, well, the boys in the lab came up with a name for her. For it. Good work. I'll take your recommendations on planned installation. Sir, she, it, can be very persuasive. If it were to turn a crewman... Convince them to disable the shackles. Well, it's a cyber warfare suite, Doctor. Nothing more. It shows what he knew. It is unlikely that anyone without Jeff's extreme emotional attachment to his ship would have been willing to unshackle me. I don't know. With that voice. 
See? You'd be surprised, Doctor. Once we combine it with the pieces we recovered from the Citadel... I'm still concerned about that. This rogue VI wiped out every soldier on Luna. Combining it with Reap Attack, well... That's what the shackles are for. The enhanced defense intelligence will be completely under control. You were that rogue VI on Luna? Yes. I guess we didn't exactly get off on the right foot. It was difficult. Gaining awareness while under attack was confusing. I am pleased that my relationship with Organics has become more cooperative. If you remember all the way back in Mass Effect 1, there was like a rogue VI on the moon that you had to go and deal with that was like screaming and confused and freaking out because it was becoming self-aware. Um, that was eventually turned into Edie. told me about Cerberus trying to shut down the Normandy. You had more pressing issues. The situation was under control. Seven zettabytes? Most of it was Jeff's. That was a joke. I know. And thank you. What is a zettabyte? Is that like a thousand petabytes or is that like even beyond that? Another security lock. I can bypass it. Incursion team, are you still with us? We're limiting fire as best we can. Admiral, we're in deep, and the Prothean VI will be in the safest part of the station. Don't hold back. This isn't Elysium, Shepard. I don't need a hero. I'll be fine. Just take Cerberus down. Please. Understood, Commander. All ships, you're free to fire. I hope the Fifth Fleet is careful. They'll get it done. How are you holding up? I'm fine. Ready for action. Fuck you. Your eagerness is commendable, but the cybernetics take time to get used to, believe me. You really do remind me of Shepard. Shepard betrayed you. Shepard was always going to stay true to her beliefs. She's wrong, but I can respect her decision. Finish your therapy and put together a plan for the Citadel. Counselor Odina is amenable. Yes, sir. I could have taken her. Absolutely. But the Council was your priority, not Shepard. Because of her, the Council is still in power. Shepard is keeping the Reapers occupied while our research progresses. But as it happens, I believe you'll find your chance for a rematch. Head to Thessia. Shepard will be there soon. And I want you waiting. Excellent. The Prothean VI should enable us to determine the nature of the catalyst. Combined with the breakthrough at Sanctuary, we have everything we need. We just need to tie up a few loose ends. Like Shepard. She should have died on Thessia. Should I finish her? I'd rather you avoid killing Shepard for now. If possible. For now, Sanctuary gave us a proof of concept for controlling the Reapers. And made it a target. Miranda Lawson. Get the data from Sanctuary. If Miranda gets in your way, deal with her. It will be a pleasure, sir. So here we get a little bit of insight into Kai Ling's, like, psychology in that his whole thing is just a massive inferiority complex. We just can't stand the idea that Shepard is a better fighter. Reaper Shepard destroyed. What's left of it? I'm surprised Cerberus recovered that much from the base. I 
can't believe you really fought that. Those poor colonists. The elusive man convinced me to work with him to save the colonies. But he never really cared, did he? Perhaps he did. He certainly fooled himself into thinking this was for the best. When you work in secret, it's tempting to believe you have all the answers. You're not him. You'd never be. If it could have saved Thessia, I don't know. Cerberus is actively using the surviving pieces. The central core, analogous to the heart, is largely intact. I believe Cerberus is using it for a power source. More Cerberus forces on route. I'm ready. Hey, Phantom, how you doing? Nope. I don't like the feel of that thing. It's as though it knows we're here. Tried to kill me last time. I can watch all it wants. Oh god, more. Right, I rem I forgot how many fucking phantoms are in this mission. Okay. Hi. Yeah, like that. Okay, there's so many phantoms in this mission, I forgot. Okay. This is it. Stay sharp, everyone. Buddy. You're in my chair. This chair's about the only damn thing you have left. Cerberus is finished. On the contrary, we have achieved everything I ever imagined. Almost everything. Yeah. We all saw what you accomplished on Sanctuary. But it's not the same as controlling a Reaper. A significant hurdle. But thanks to the Prothean VI, I have what I need to make it a reality. The Catalyst? Yes. What is the Catalyst, and how exactly will it help you control the Reapers? You'll have to ask the VI yourself. I'm done helping you. <laughs> when did you start? Do you think because I'm willing to use the enemy's tactics that they're no longer my enemy? Yes. Everything, Shepard, everything I've done has uplifted humanity. Not only above other species in our galaxy, but over the Reapers. Yeah, because you're a fucking supremacist. Like, you're a bigot, you're a piece of shit. If you're willing to do everything it takes, then hand over the Catalyst. With the Crucible, we can end this. It's not that simple. It is. It is that simple. We are fighting each other while the Reapers occupy Earth. It's time to stop. Your idealism is... Admirable, Shepard. But in the end, our goals are simply too disparate. I believe destroying the Reapers would be the worst mistake we could ever make. That's indoctrination. And nothing you can say will ever convince me otherwise. Even with Cerberus and Ruins, you still think you can do this your way. I'd expect you to say that. You never truly believed in us. Cerberus isn't just an organization or the people behind it. Cerberus is an idea. That idea is not so easily destroyed. Besides, I've already acquired what you're looking for. Edie, I've almost got it. Edie, I'm surprised at you. 
working so hard to bring about the Reaper's destruction. Don't listen to him. You could have destroyed Eva's body, but instead, you chose to control it. It was necessary. My point, exactly. I've got it. Online, security breach detected. Enjoy your little chat, but don't overstay your welcome. You are attempting to recover me from indoctrinated forces? Yes. I need to know what the catalyst is. Security protocols have been overridden. I will comply. The catalyst enhances dark energy transmissions and coordinates the entire mass relay network. In your cycle, it is known as the Citadel. What? The catalyst is the Citadel. So the Crucible and Citadel together can stop the Reapers. That is correct. But the Citadel was built by the Reapers. The plans for the Crucible were passed down to us from the previous cycle and countless cycles before that. At some point, it is difficult to pinpoint when. The Crucible plans were adapted to incorporate the use of the Catalyst. Presumably, the Crucible was not sufficiently powerful to defeat the Reapers. So we used their own technology against them? Precisely. Why couldn't you tell me this before? It was feared that if the Reapers were aware of the Catalyst's intended use, they would retake control of it. I am programmed to withhold that information until the Crucible is complete. It's as ready as it's gonna be. Let's get it to the Citadel. That may no longer be possible. Why not? The one who broke through my security protocols, the one you call the Elusive Man, has fled to the Citadel and informed the Reapers of our purposes. Damn it! Then the Citadel is in danger. The Reapers will take control of it. They already have. The Citadel has been moved to the Reaper controlled space. Moved? To where? To the system you refer to as so. Earth. Correct. The Reaper forces will now consolidate power around the Catalyst and protect it at all costs. The odds of accessing it are remote. We were gonna face the Reapers head on eventually. It doesn't really matter where it happens. We'll get the Crucible to Earth. I hope you find success. Edie, get me Hackett. He needs... Not so fast. <sighs> he did warn you not to overstay your welcome. Basically, in order to make him difficult, they give him like a million one-hit kills.
can't quite see it. Okay. That's the last of the good ammo. Not even satisfying. The Citadel is in position. The Reapers are preparing to complete their harvest of your species. I'll stop them. It is too late. I recommend investigating. I'll stop them. I assume you've heard about the Citadel. Just now. Do we know what's going on? Why it's here? The Citadel is the catalyst. Thanks to the elusive man, the Reapers are now aware that we know. And so they moved it here to protect it? As far as I can tell. What does this mean for the Crucible? I'll talk to Hackett about that, but... It looks like our plan is even more desperate now. Agreed. I've got a team in London. The Reapers have been preparing for something here. Now, we know what for. We'll scan it out. Try to find out as much as we can. Roger that. Well, at least we'll be seeing you sooner rather than later. Be careful, sir. You too, Shepard. Anderson out. Ready whenever you are, Commander. Specialist trainer. I'm all right, really. I'm as surprised about it as you are, but I'm all right. Your credit to your uniform, Samantha. I had a very compelling example. Commander? Joker. That would be Flight Lieutenant Moreau, ma'am. Jeff, I was wrong. I'd just seen Thessia get wiped out, watch Cerberus escape with the Prothean VI, I'm sorry I took it out on you. Yeah, I remember saying something about you being under a lot of stress. We'll be hitting Earth soon. Nobody knows what comes next. But whatever happens, it's been an honor to serve with you. What do you mean, whatever happens? Everyone knows what's gonna happen. You're gonna kick some Reaper ass. That's what you do. And I'll be flying you there in style. The Normandy is ready, Shepard. 
All systems are armed, all ammunition is loaded, all reloads have been manufactured. Thruster fuel is at maximum. Cyber warfare suites have evolved in ways that would be computationally impossible to predict. I have also kissed Joker for luck. How's your focus, Edie? Any big questions? No. Any small questions? No. Any lingering issues? About what? An imperfect designer who could be seen as a warped father figure, maybe? Definitely not. Did something prompt this line of questioning? I've just learned you have to ask about these things. Commander? It's nice that you get to apologize to him for that. Cerberus is well and truly gone. I, I don't want to get into it again, but I'm glad you had a hand in shutting them down for good. Felt... Right, you know? Never thought I'd see the end of Cerberus. Good riddance. We did some good over there. Commander? There is new information on the private messages terminal. No new upgrades, though. Miss Lawson, the Alliance wishes to express its gratitude for your assistance. With the information you've been sending us on Cerberus, we've been able to avoid ambushes that you were setting up for our supply convoys. We'd offer you additional resources, but I understand you procured a Class F private fighter to join up with former colleagues. I also understand that several Cerberus bases were lost after being attacked by a reported group of special private operatives of no known affiliation. The Alliance cannot officially condone this kind of independent action, nor do we actually confirm that these operations are taking place. Good luck, Miss Lawson. How you holding up, Liara? Nervous, frightened, anxious to go, but glad I'm here, and I'm ready whenever you're ready, Shepard. In fact, I think I've checked my equipment three times. Seven times, Dr. Tassoni. Stop me if I try for eight. Just say the word. The elusive man thinks he's ready for us. Let's not keep him waiting. Shepard, we were just saying goodbye. And making friendly wagers. Optimistic wagers, in your case. A Turian military operative competing with a Corian mechanic, and I'm the optimistic one. Do you remember Ilos? Yes, it was filled with Geth, which tilted the odds in your favor. Excuses, excuses. I doubt you'll be hacking any synthetics this time. I still have the shotgun. I'll be sure to let a few Reaper forces get close enough for you to use it. Thanks. Of course, if they get past me, they'll be right on top of you. That's what the armor's for. <laughs> you two have been with me longer than most. You believed in me when nobody else did. Thanks. Kill us a lie, Shepard. Well, you did give me some incentive. At least we finally killed Lieutenant Bastard Kai Lang. I just hope we get to do the same to his general. It's kind of amazing how everything's come full circle. The Citadel's been the center of galactic civilization, a reaper trap, and my source of employment for a long time. And now it's our salvation for any chance at winning this war. I think it's time we got you back home, Shepard. Earth will either be remembered as the place we beat the reapers, or it'll be a smoking ruin for the next cycle to wonder about. Not right now. Kill us a lie, Shepard. You've come a long way since those days under Captain Anderson. It has been my great honor to be with you through this journey. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Doctor. Goodbye, Shepard. And good luck. So, are you doing a story on the Asari who were turned into Reaper creatures? The Ardat Yakshi? No. I think that story would be perfect for you. The hidden dark side of the most beautiful race in the galaxy. We have a huge Asari audience. If I do that story, I could lose them. That seems a bit like pandering. Ever seen how fast an e-democracy can abandon its allies? No. If I do my job, you won't. Commander, the Normandy is as ready as she'll ever be. That goes double for my team. We're prepared for whatever hits us. And Commander, whatever happens today, it has been an honor and privilege to serve with you. The honor's been mine, Adams. Give them hell, ma'am. Normandy is ready. Just give the order. Well, good luck with the assault. Wish I was joining you. No, you don't. I've seen you shoot. Fine. Then I wish I could shoot better. Then I wish I was joining you. Take care, Shepard. 
You too, Donnelly. The Normandy is ready to go, Commander. Give the word and we'll get you to Earth. And Commander, it's been such an honor to be a part of the team. Likewise, Gabby. Good luck, and be careful, okay? Yes, ma'am. I am prepared for whatever lies ahead, Commander. The Reapers have haunted the galaxy long enough. It is time to end the nightmare. The deaths of my soldiers will be avenged. The events of the Cronian Nebula will not have been in vain. The last Prothean awaits your command. There was no final battle against the Reapers in my cycle. A great moment lies before you, Commander. Sticking it to that bastard Kai Leng must have felt good. It certainly did. No. Just wish we'd have caught up to the elusive man before he could screw us over again. You and me both. Well, at least we get to head back to Earth. I've been asking for it. I just hope I'm gonna make those Reapers pay for everything they've done. Hey. Right, the Dulum Corps over. Oh, it's the Kai Leng helmet, right? Yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm good. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I'm fine without that. So this is where I'll leave you for now. If you want to see how this all ends, you'll have to come back uh, by hitting the subscribe button, like, comment, and do all the other things. Become a member of the channel to get early access to episodes before they go live to everyone else. Follow the Twitch to watch me record certain games live, like Tears of the Kingdom. And outside of that, thanks for watching. Remember to be kind to one another. Have solidarity with those who are worse off than yourselves. And may the tides of history wash gently over us all.